video would love some phrases that barely even sounded like English. Do I even speak my own language? I don't know. Um, right. Okay, so let's go to... <laughs> I only speak English and sarcasm. Well, I mean, that's good and all, but it's not an, uh, another language to me. So I, I'm very fluent in sarcasm. Can't you tell? Uh, but the first other one is have a Dutch tongue twister. Oh, God. This is the part that gets really bad, because I have to try and pronounce the language as well as guess what the actual thing I just butchered means. So, Dutch. What does Dutch sound like? I don't fucking know. Um, the cat crab the coolen van die trap. Um, okay, so the cat, the cat crabbed, um, the, I want to assume that de is the, you Dutch people, you have your heads on a swivel, because you, you shorten the into de. <laughs> Bravo! Uh, the cat grabbed the, the, the cruel mouse trap. <coughs> what does that actually mean? The cat scratches the curls of the stairs. What? The cat crabbed the coolen van trap. Van trap. I fucked it up! <laughs> that was like a tongue twister though. That doesn't seem like it'd be all that difficult. Then again, I don't speak Dutch. Um, I, I mean, I got the cat, but <laughs> I didn't get the rest of it. Fuck. Wait, I, I don't know what this is. It looks like Swedish. I'm not going to guess Swedish. So hopefully, it, it, oh god. Tien loka araso men an van e plusto. I kind of know how Swedish goes by looking at it. That was not it, by the way. But I messed it all up there. Okay, let's try and guess what this means. I don't say it like uh, a person who just speaks English and just want to bother trying to learn other languages would say it. Titan laker alasar men an van e plaster. Well, that's how an Irish person would say it because we're such uncultured bastards over here. Uh, right, so the lake tide knows that men need plasters. <laughs> Peanuts. Iku van op op gets volle 
accents. Uh, there's like, cause normally I kind of know from the accents and some languages have like umlauts and agus and all these types of things and fadas and I don't know, and then other languages just completely written in different letters. But this one's confusing. I'm gonna guess it's Polish. Cause this looks like a Polish word. Can you please open, uh, no. Can you please open swole? <laughs> open swole. It sounds like open swole. Yeah, I'm open swole, baby. That's what I said, this doesn't make any sense though. Can you please open swole? Whatever. It's Dutch and it means I love Obi Dick. <laughs> This is my brother Dick. <laughs> Why is it so funny? Okay, uh, gracias por todo lo que haces, me haces feliz. I, I, I see this written everywhere, and I always think, I always look at it, and immediately I think Felix, and I think it's a name, but I know that that's not what it is. This, this is Spanish or Portuguese. Um, thank you for existing. No, thank you for the. Haces? Haces. Thank you for the times. I, I, my name's Felix. Thank you for all that you do, you make me happy. Oh, you guys are too nice when you do this. I keep expecting like really bad things, like touch the inside of my bubble. I really appreciate that. Oh, I need to find some swears. I need to balance it out. I'm feeling dirty. See, this is, uh, somebody said some Russian. But because I have no idea how to pronounce these letters, I, I wouldn't even know where to start. I mean, I could say it the way they look to me, which would be Mamki Taboho Eman, which is not right at all. M Mommy bought something on eBay. It's not even, it's not even a translate thing. God damn it, Twitter. Apparently, it translated from Russian into your nurse fucked. I have a nurse? That's the part that's shocking to me. Not that she fucked, apparently. But that nurse! <laughs> Who's my nurse? Ooh, some Albanian. Thank you. I don't need to guess this one. <laughs> Oh god, how does Albanian go? I don't think I've ever heard Albanian. If I have, it's, I don't know how it sounds. Um, who did to do a tea? <laughs> who did to do a tie? Who did to, I like the, the bounciness of it. It sounds very, well, the way I'm saying it sounds very bouncy. So I like that. Um, one, two, three, four. I'm gonna guess what the sun says. One, two, buckle my shoe. That's what it means. It, it didn't translate from anything. Okay, thank you, Bing. It's proving once again why everyone uses Google. Oh, it's I love you again. Stop it. Like, who's dead? How dare they get more? Oh, seriously, though, thank you so much. That's, you guys are too nice. Then why do I need this episode here? That's it. It's over. You killed me. You killed me with kindness. Seriously, thank you. Not, not only for participating in these things, it really means a lot to me that you do, because not only does it give, like, like it's something to record, but the main reason is because it gets us all together to actually do something. And I love that. I love I love stuff that lets me interact directly. That's why I love doing reading comments videos. That's why I love doing these, drawing your tweets. Anything that gives you guys more interaction with the actual content that's happening. That you have actual input on what's being done in the video. I mean, that's, that's why people love live streams and everything as well. Um, So it, it's really cool to have that direct contact and that direct influence with all of you, and then to have it come into the video like that. That's really cool. Thank you so much for all the really nice messages. Again, when I did this, like, the first couple of times, everyone was putting in like boobies, butt cracks, farts, vaginas, all that kind of stuff. And it, it got very ridiculous very fast. But everyone was just being super nice to me. So thank you. That, that's really cool. I really appreciate it. Sorry if I didn't get to your phrase or, or even your language. And it's always a case of there's such a huge chunk of people speaking the same language a lot of the time that I, I end up seeing the same languages over and over and over again. I don't want to like prioritize different languages or say like 15 French ones and then two other languages or something like that. So I try and diversify things. Sometimes it's hard because I don't know what the languages are when I look at them. So I might be picking the same languages over and over again without actually knowing it. But I like to diversify it. And I think it shows how cool it is that. Doing YouTube videos is worldwide. It is diverse. There's a lot of different people from a lot of different cultures and backgrounds and languages and ethnicities who watch YouTube, and I find that fascinating. I think it's so cool. This is another reason I wanted to do this, was asking people for phrases in their own languages, just as a general thing, but I wanted to turn it into a video and something fun that you could all get something out of as well. But I just, I was so curious to see what, what languages people spoke, where the most languages were spoken, who was the most interactive, and what languages were the most interactive, that kind of thing, and it's just, it, it blows me away. I, I still can't believe that a small little Irish boy sits in his room and records these types of things, and there's people from all over the world who interact with it. It's so mind-blowing, so thank you for that. But also, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, punch that like banana face! Wiggle boys, and... I went the road. Thank you guys for that You're welcome.